and President Ford was going to vaccinate the entire population of America, every man, woman and child, black, white and brindle, against a particular type of flu called swine flu because he'd been advised that there was going to be a huge epidemic that would kill thousands of people. Now I spoke out against it and the newspapers got hold of it and eventually I appeared on Kathy Cosby's television program and I specifically said that many people would drop dead after receiving the vaccines, particularly if they had a heart problem or a potential heart problem. Now there was someone in New York watching the program who didn't like a gentleman called Gambino. Gambino is about 70 years old, the mafia boss. He thought, now this is a great idea. So he got someone to persuade Gambino to have his flu shot and Gambino promptly dropped dead. And the newspaper headings at the time actually said, Mafia Flu Jab Conspiracy. Now people were dropping dead in the buildings where they received their shots. Many others became paralysed. And the whole program ground to a halt. Now the important thing, really, is that I was the only physician anywhere in the world who warned about these side effects. And this is very important because I'm just an ordinary medical practitioner without specialist qualifications. I wasn't even an American. And yet, I was the only one. Everybody else spoke out in favour of this campaign. And it's very, very obvious that everybody else was wrong and only one was right. The whole program ground to a halt. There wasn't even a single case of swine flu. There was never an epidemic of swine flu. And why it was that the world's most powerful man with the world's most powerful Department of Health got it so wrong, we will never know. But it's important to realise that he did get it wrong and that the authorities did get it wrong.